Hello children, my name's Seema. Let's start our Letters and Sounds lesson and learn to read. This week we have been learning to say the phonemes and read the graphemes for th or th, ng, a and e. Can you remember what a digraph is? Yes, two letters that make one sound. You will need paper and something to write with. Let's read some phonemes you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the card and I want you to read them aloud. This first card is a digraph. It says A. Now it's your turn. Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. A E K Ch Sh F or Z Ng Now I'm going to mix the cards up. Read the graphemes on the cards aloud. Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. Ng. E. Sh th or th. Let's practice reading words together and find out what's in the box. Ooh, I can see a m o th. M o th. What is it? Tell me. Are you right? Let's check. Read the word with me. Can you see the digraph for th? Yes, here it is. Two letters, one sound. Read with me. M, O, F, Moth. Good job. Let's read the word again. M, O, F, Moth. Yes, it's a moth. Well done. What's this? It's a r i ng. R i ng. What is it? Tell me. Are you right? Let's check. Read the word with me. Can you see the digraph for ng? Yes, there it is. Read with me. R -i -ng. Ring. Good job. Let's read the word again. R -i -ng. Ring. Yes, it's a ring. It's a pretty one, isn't it? What's this? It's f e t. F e t. What is it? Tell me, are you right? Let's check. Read the word with me. Can you see the digraph for E? Yes, there it is. Two letters, one sound. Read with me. F E T Feet. Good job. Let's read the word again. F E T Feet. Yes, it's feet. Can you move on your feet? What's this? It's r a n. R a n. What is it? Tell me. Are you right? Let's check. 
Read the word with me. Can you see the digraph for A? Yes, there it is. Read with me. R A N Rain. Good job. Let's read the word again. R A N Rain. Yes, it rain. Well done. Now, let's put them back in the box. This time I want you to read the words without any help. Say the sounds as I point and then blend and read. Now, let's read the word together. F -e -t. Feet. Let's put the feet back in the box. Say the sounds as I point, then blend and read. Now, let's read the word together. R -e -ng. Ring. Let's put the ring back in the box. Say the sounds as I point, then blend and read the word. Now let's read the word together. M -o -th. Moth. Let's put the moth back in the box. Bye bye moth. Say the sounds as I point, then blend and read. Now let's read the word together. R-A-N. Rain. Let's put the rain back in the box. Great job. Everything is back in the box. Now let's play another game. I want you to read the words and then match each word to the correct picture. Read each sound as I point, then blend and read the word. Look at the pictures. Point to the picture that matches the word. Fox. Fox. Did you get it right? Read each sound, then blend. Point to the picture that matches the word. Zip. Zip. Did you get it right? Can you spot digraphs? Remember, two letters, one sound. Yes, there are two digraphs in this word. The first is sh and the second is l. Read each sound, then blend. Point to the picture that matches the word. Sh -e -l. Shell. Did you get it right? Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is ng. Read each sound, then blend. Point to the picture that matches the word. Wing. Did you get it right? Now I'm going to mix the words up. I can't wait to hear you read. Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. Let's see how speedy we can be. Zip. Shell. Wing. Fox. Children, you are reading so well. Let's read a sentence 
with graphemes we already know. This capital letter says T. We start a sentence with a capital letter. Can you see any words with the digraph? Yes, this word has the digraph. Also, this word has the digraph. Digraphs are two letters and one sound. Can you see any words with another digraph? Yes, this word has the digraph ng. Now, I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Remember to sound out any words you're not sure of. Excellent reading. Now, let's read this together. Read with me as I point to the words. The moth has thin wings. Let's read this one more time. The moth has thin wings. This moth has very thin wings. It flaps its wings to fly. Let's finish by spelling some words because if you can read a word then you can have a go at spelling it. You will need paper and something to write with. Let's spell two words. Let's spell shell. Segment the sounds with me. Shell. Sh, e, l. Let's count how many sounds there are. Sh, e, l. That's three sounds. Watch me write shell. I need three sounds. Sh is a digraph. Two letters, one sound. So I need to write two letters. L. L is a digraph. Two letters, one sound. So I need to write two letters. Shell. Sh, e, l. Shell. Let's hide the word. Now, you have a go. Say the word. Say the sound. Write them down. Don't forget digraphs. Sh and l. Two letters, one sound. Let's check your spelling. Show me your spelling. Did you get it right? Shell. Sh. E. Eh. L. Shell. Let's try another word. Let's spell wing. Segment the sounds with me. Wing. W. I. Ng. Let's count how many sounds there are in wing. W. I. Ng. That's three sounds. Watch me write wing. I need three sounds. W. I. Ng. Ng is a digraph. Two letters, one sound. So I need to write two letters. Wing. W. I. Ng. Wing. Let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sound. Write them down. Don't forget digraph. Ng. Two letters, one sound. Let's check our spelling. Show me your spelling. Did you get it right? 
wing. E ng wing. Well done, children. You work so hard practicing reading and spelling. See you soon for another lesson with letters and sounds. <laughs>